Staying with the world of technology, last week France announced a bold entry into the world of artificial intelligence. French President Emmanuel Macron announced that his government will pump in nearly $2 billion by 2022 to develop artificial intelligence assets. Macron wants France to challenge the growing dominance of the United States and China by becoming a leading player in technology. Ce sera un effort dédié d'un milliard et demi d'euros, entraînant directement plus de 500 millions d'euros d'investissement privé supplémentaire qui sera mis en œuvre pour accompagner l'émergence de ce grand pôle mondial de l'intelligence artificielle. Je souhaite que la France soit l'un des leaders de cette intelligence artificielle. Je souhaite que l'Europe soit l'un des leaders de cette intelligence artificielle. This is a rather ambitious target that President Macron has set for himself. France is not known as a destination for technology innovation, unlike the United States. Venture capital investments are limited in France, held back by strict tax rules. And the French government, which has a fiscal deficit of 2.6% of the GDP, will be unable to match China's level of state investment towards artificial intelligence. So how are they going to do it? Just in January, the Chinese government announced that it will invest a little more than $2 billion towards building an industrial park for artificial intelligence research. On the other side, we have France spending $1.85 billion over five years to jumpstart an entire artificial intelligence ecosystem. It is a daunting task. What can Macron offer to the world? that the U.S. and China cannot. He has to come up with a USP. This announcement comes at a time when there is a raging debate around the world over privacy of data. And by announcing this fund, Macron basically wants to take the lead in developing technologies that safeguard the principles and values of privacy. In an interview to Wired magazine after the announcement, the president of France described the rise of artificial intelligence as a political revolution, laying a strong emphasis on the need for a value system President Macron said that he wants artificial intelligence to be federalized. He's even made a promise to keep all algorithms developed by the French government open. These algorithms developed through funding from the French government uh, are going to change the game, at least that's what he hopes for. What is the game plan is the question. According to reports, the government of France is planning to, planning to leverage its foreign brain trust, state-owned data, and connections to European research institutes to develop an ecosystem for development of artificial intelligence technologies. While there are several possible applications for this technology, President Macron feels healthcare and mobility are the two key sectors where AI will have a deep and immediate impact. His government, though, uh, through this AI fund, will support research and startups working with artificial intelligence technologies in an attempt to become a global innovation hub.